First and foremost, I think the feelings I have is a sense of deep gratitude. Uh, the fact that we were able to uh, move mountains, um, circumvent so many obstacles that were in our way. It's all been possible by the sheer hard work of all the faculty, staff and administrators that put their heart and soul into the effort of creating the School of Pharmacy here at AUHS. A school that's going to stand apart. It's not going to be the same old, same old pharmacy program. We're going to graduate pharmacists. We're going to go out there and make a difference. A difference in people's lives. Take care of people who are really in need. And for that, I think all the effort, all the trials and tribulations that we have been through is worth it today. And seeing all this happen in front of our eyes, it's really, again, as I said, um, it's a deep sense of gratitude that, yes, we were able to come here. Uh, this is actually the fourth school of pharmacy that I helped start, and this one as a founding dean. And um, it, it's really sort of trying to figure out, you know, what we need in today's day and age. What do we need to have to take care of our patients? And that's really is the question that drives all of us. And if you look at the current landscape of pharmacy, it is changing. Uh, the way we need to take care of our patients, the things we need to have in place so that we can really help our patients get the optimal health care has changed so much in the past 10, 15 years. And this is what I think really drives me to get up and you know work for a school of pharmacy that's going to create that pharmacist, that's going to out, be out there, be part of an interprofessional team that provides optimal health care to the patient. And to that effect, I think uh, this is really different in terms of my other previous endeavors, where um, we are really trying to make a difference in the community that we serve, the community we are part of. Uh, we really want to make sure that we take care of people who can't take care of themselves. Uh, we need to help the underprivileged and the underserved because they really don't have anybody to turn to. And if we cannot do that, then who will? Somebody has to take charge. And I really like this uh, quote uh, from the Bible where, um, you know, it says that, here I am, please send me. And that's really what I believe towards, that, you know, the challenge has been thrown forth. And who is there who's going to take up this challenge? And for me, yes, I want to step up. I want to take on the responsibility. I want to educate and train the next generation of pharmacists who are going to make a difference in today's world. Take care of people that have nowhere to turn to. At uh, typical schools of pharmacy, uh, you would expect anywhere from 2 to 4 percent of attrition. Um, and for us, we really don't have a choice. We have 25 great students and we want to graduate each and every one of them. So for me, I'm looking at a 100% success rate. For me, what I really look for is more of the attitude in a student. Uh, sometimes, you know, book smart can only take you up to a certain point. I think book smarts will get you into pharmacy school, but beyond that, it's your uh, attitude and uh, the never do die attitude that can take you forward and really you know, help you cross that threshold into becoming a pharmacist. So for me, it's really the attitude that I look for in a prospective student or an applicant.